I've got to be where my spirit can run free. I've got to find my corner of the sky. Teen Jordan Levinson goes to a school for youth with learning disabilities and wows everyone with his singing. Seventeen-year-old Joey Lowenstein, who has autism, snows everyone with his sports skills. People with mental health issues should be loved and sincerely supported by the community. Nineteen-year-old Chiara de Blasio, daughter of the New York City mayor, publicly admitted her battle with depression and alcohol and drug I've use. I've had depression, like clinical depression, for like my entire adolescence. Um, and so that's been something that I've always dealt with um, or not known how to deal with. Shame over being different can drive some kids to tragedy, as it did for 19-year-old Tyler Clementi, who jumped off the George Washington Bridge to his death after being cyberbullied when he was viewed on a webcam kissing another male. There are about a billion young people in the world, and it's estimated that about one in five of them have mental health problems, yet not enough of them, only about 20%, get the kind of help that they need. To combat such shame um, and stigma, and, not, and to raise awareness, Kiara stars in this public service campaign. But it's so worth it. As the representatives of the major group for children and youth here at the UN in New York, we think it's critical to reach out to policymakers, to ambassadors, to members of UN staff, to make sure they understand the importance of mental health when it comes to young people. And now, the United Nations is also raising awareness about youth with mental health challenges. The Mental Health Matters campaign, organized by the UN Department of Economic and Social Affairs and the Office of the Secretary General's Envoy on Youth, launched in June 2014 with a celebration on International Youth Day, August 12th. My friends, the sun is shining. But I only see darkness. To any young person who struggles with the mental health issues, I say, the United Nations supports you. We believe in your ability to improve our world, and we want to help you realize that potential for our collective future. Young people with mental health are calling for acceptance, and they call for other young people to join them in fighting the stigma that surrounded mental health. The publication, I mean, I, I, it's on the website and it's at uh, www.un.org youth. And just this past July, in a historic move, governments of the UN agreed to include in their proposed text for the Sustainable Development Goals a commitment to promote mental health and well-being. They include to end poverty, ensure quality education, achieve gender equality, promote decent work, protect the forests and oceans, and promote peaceful societies. I see the youth as the, the real potential uh, leaders, the potential movement uh, to transform the world. In the UN spirit of partnership between governments and civil society, Ambassador Otto and the Palau Mission partnered with the Psychology Coalition at the United Nations that I chair. Discussions were held with over 80 representatives from the 193 governments that are member states of the United Nations, and for the first time ever, a Friends of Mental Health and Wellbeing group was formed and meetings held to strategize about the issue. Recognizing that the world cannot be sustainable unless people's well-being is also embraced, this is a very important breakthrough. There is a big economic cost associated with mental illness, and when it occurs among young people, it can become a lifetime impediment. Any government has to take care of the youngsters because they are the future of the country, and the responsibility of the government is uh, very, very high. I mean, in order to give quality of life to your youth, you have to think in policies uh, to promote sports, to promote education. It tears me apart to see young people discarded on the streets, left to room because they're quote-unquote abnormal in their behavior. I would like to see that eradicated. Ambassadors had advice for youth. Je demande aux jeunes d'aujourd'hui de rêver et de transformer leur rêve en réalité. This is about your total strength 
and mental health is part of this strength in you. I encourage you to be creative, to be energetic, to be active and be fearless. I got to be where my spirit can run free. Gotta find my corner of the Everything has its time. Show me a reason, and I'll soon show you rhyme. Cats fit on the windowsill, children fit in the snow. But why do I feel I don't fit in anywhere I go? Rivers belong where they can ramble, eagles belong where they can fly. I've got to be where my spirit can run free. Gotta find my.